Hello students, welcome to another video of Color Stack powered by Slidescope. In this video, we are going to analyze IPL data with Power BI and this is the part 1. So here we have that IPL data and you can download it from Kaggle.com or I will put the link in the description from where you can easily get this data set. In this data set, you can see there are two files. So, one file is IPL ball by ball, and this data is from 2008, that means a start of IPL to 2022. So, 2023 data is not there. So, you just have to follow the procedure. If you get 2000 8 to 2023 data then also the procedure will be the same similarly we have ipl matches data here so as you can see there are two files in one file you have data of all the matches which means in every match there is id city date on which that match was played season fine uh, match number that means whether it was final qualifier or whatever the match number in that particular season was team 1 team 2 venue toss winner toss decision super over and winning team won by if the team won by wickets or whether the team won by runs so when team bats first they usually win by wickets so that's how it is there. Now we have player of the match, team 1 players. So team 1 players, if you will see, it is a list of all the players. So this data is in form of a list. Team 2 players, again in form of list. So wherever we will need them, we will use these columns. So the, here one important column is ID every match has a unique id and this unique id is important as it is linked in this ipl ball by ball data set so you can see an id here so here you can see every match has a unique id and based on for example 13 1 2 2 double zero so 131220 and here you will see 131220 so you will find many records for this particular match and if you will scroll down so in a match there are usually two 240 uh, balls or deliveries here it is 234 so sometimes the other team gets all out of because of whatever reason so in one innings there are 120 balls so in two innings there will be 240 balls usually but it may be less it may be more than that because of no balls and extra balls so you must have some basic understanding of ipl and cricket in particular in order to understand this data set now let's get started with power bi so we have our power bi desktop here and i after opening your power bi desktop you just have to connect your data set so to connect your data set click get data here and when you will click get data this particular screen will open where you will see a list of various data sets name of data sets our data set is a CSV file which you can see here it's a comma separated values file and it is stored in downloads folder so when it's a CSV file you just have to click text CSV and then you have to navigate to that particular folder where your data is there now I will go to this folder and first I will select any one of these files because IPL matches 2008 to 2022 this file is 
the main file the first file we will select this although you can select any other file and here you can see that file is loaded here with all the data delimiter is comma in this file and this data is based on first 200 rows we can simply load it so once the load is complete you will see this data now since we have two files so what we are going to do is we will click on get that data text csv and we'll load the second file also and now you can see a preview of this file and we will load this data as well and now you can see our ipl ball by ball and ipl matches these two files have been loaded now let's analyze very basic things in ipl so we will analyze a simple thing like venue wise number of matches played so when we look at the data again this is a very simple thing that we are going to analyze but as a beginner of uh, power bi if you are learning power bi then this will give you a simple idea how we can analyze such basic things and then we will explore this data then we will explore this data for more advanced queries as well so first of all i will close this first of all let's go to the matches part and here you will see a column called venue in this column we have names of all the stadiums where that match was played and in total we have 951 such matches if we uh, ignore the first row so it has around 950 matches so for that we will go to ipl matches and then we can simply click on venue as you can see here when you click on venue you will see distinct name of all those venues here you can see a simple thing uh, so in this data let me first right click here and show as table so here you can see arun jetli stadium and arun jetli stadium delhi well brabon stadium and brabon stadium mumbai some of sometimes these stadium names are repeated twice because uh, their name was written without their city in some rows and their name was written with their city in other rows so when we will do some kind of data cleaning in our other chapters where you will learn how to clean the data so that Uh, small things like this will not appear arun jetli stadium arun jetli stadium delhi are basically only one venue so we will clean this data in other chapters or you can do it simply in excel also you can find and replace so we'll discuss that so now you can see this table has uh, has been loaded here you can simply drag and Uh, expand this in order to see the data so now we have a uh, name of all those uh, venues which are here and we have to create another column where it will show you number of matches in that column and to do that we have a simple step here we will write a simple dax query here So to write your DAX query, go to Modeling, click on New Measure. When you are when we are creating a new measure, 
so this is the name of that column that will appear or the name of that field that will appear here so what we are going to do is let me do that once again so first of all i will remove it i click something we will go to model we will create a new measure we will name it as num matches which simply means number of matches and here we will do count rows so count rows will count how many in how many rows this name has appeared and we will count rows of ipl matches this particular file so you have to type the name of that file in which you have to count the number of matches and put a end bracket here and click enter hit enter and now you will see a field is created here now we just have to drag this field into our view or our dashboard and you will see that in this stadium we have 14 matches so let's show as a table and you can see the total is 950 and now we have a stadium wise number of matches so this was a basic uh, introduction of how to count something uh, if you have a dimension here or if your column ha if your column is a categorical column where you have nominal values so for example in venue we have uh, various distinct values and you want to count how many times that particular name has appeared for example how many times eden gardens has appeared or how many times brabon stadium has appeared so you can follow this simple trick or you can follow this simple procedure to count that like you can see in eden garden 77 and eden garden kolkata 2 so this way after cleaning the data you will get sorry after cleaning the data you will get the exact number of records so we will come up with more analysis related to ipl IPL exploratory data analysis with Power BI. So stay tuned. Uh, follow our channel to get regular updates. Subscribe to our channel and uh, also hit the bell icon to get regular updates related to your favorite topic.